What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you how to factory reset your quick set halo lock. Now this is the fingerprint version, but this reset process is going to be the same for the numeric keypad as well as the fingerprint door locks. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the two trim screws on either side. Um, sometimes there's also one on the bottom, so there might be that third one. Then we can go ahead and remove the front plate. And to restart the reset process, we're going to um, take out the battery pack. Now with the battery pack out, we're going to press and hold the program button and then reinsert the battery pack. Remember to keep it held in. We're going to count to 30 seconds. And this is true 30 seconds, so keep your finger on it. After the 30 seconds, we're going to let go. Now this is great if you need to just uh, change your Wi-Fi settings, you need to delete any user codes, or you need the door to relearn its orientation. Uh, if you move into a new house or you move out of a house, this is also a good process to do. If you forgot the application username and password, then you can set up a new application and repair this door lock. Now we're going to let go. You're going to see the light start flashing. Press it one more time and it's going to flash red and green. Let it stay that way. And now we're going to let the door stay freely. So I'm just going to keep it open and it's going to relearn the door lock orientation. So right now it just went through that orientation process and we are good to go guys. So that is how you factory reset your quick set door lock. Um, now no user codes will be stored in here. The application will not be paired anymore. It won't be connected to your network and you can set it up just like new. If you guys need instructions on how to set this up, go ahead and check out one of my other videos down here. Now I want to mention guys, if you guys do have the quick set app on your phone, we want to open that up and in this lock settings on the bottom left, we can delete the lock and that is going to be good because it will just remove the lock from our account. There you go, the lock has been successfully deleted and now we can recreate our lock or re-add it to our account. If you guys did find the video helpful, please smash that thumbs up, I really appreciate it. And please subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate that as well. See you guys in the next one, thanks for watching, bye.